Hey, what is going on, guys? Quad MFT here, your favorite commentator, bringing you your favorite dual commentary series with, of course, the one and only Dad. Hello, son. Hello, father. So, what are we looking at here today? Um, today we're on the map hard hat playing the usual domination using the PP90 with suppressor and extended mags. Kind of an overused gun, but I had a gameplay with it and it was pretty long, so I thought I might use it and it was a really good gameplay. And I'm using the specials kill streaks, which definitely are my favorite like tier of kill streak versus assault and support. It's definitely specialist. Is right that kind of a is that kind of a rushing class you have on? Yeah, it's using uh sleight of hand is my first uh, specialist perk, second is assassin and the third is steady aim. And uh, but you, that that's what I like to run now. So. Okay, so you're playing you're playing this game to get kills. Well, I mean, basically not to get kills. It was to kind of go for the Moab. It's kind of a Moab fail. I think I die on an 18. Not gonna tell you how I die, but I uh -huh. do die on an 18, and uh -huh. I do pick up my specialist bonus quite a few can times. I, can I guess? Do you die of malaria? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it. I yeah. knew it. It's a slow, painful death to watch. Yeah. Especially on a commentary. But uh, some people get knives. Some people get uh, predatored. You died of malaria. <laughs> yeah, so that that's kind of a weird way to die in Call of Duty, but I did die of that. It happens. It happens. Hey, um, speaking of weird things in Call of Duty, um, you whoa, there, he was just standing there. I yeah. just wanted to drop that that uh, ammo off for you. you yeah. Hey, look what I brought you. Hey, um, you went and saw a movie the other day. It was uh, a lot I... like Call of Duty. I guess you could call it kind of like Call of Duty. It's called Act of Valor. Act of Valor, which is Call of Duty. Sure. And was was it similar? Was I mean I didn't see it. And I mean they I actually had quite a few first person views, like you can see, like all you see right now is my hands. Well, mainly my one hand, but you can kind of see the tip of my finger pulling the trigger, and you can see the gun. They had, they had like views like that in the game. I mean, eight in the movie, or, eight or nine of those views, and it just with like an M4 with the holographic, and it looked pretty cool. If no one had said anything, would you have thought Call of Duty before you went? I mean, after you went? Oh, totally, so totally, it definitely reminded you. And the story was good. Yeah, I mean, it was like a family thing, and it was just just a pretty decent movie. I'd give it like a eight out of ten. Oh, that's pretty. Hey, that's good. That's a B. Yep. Man, you had, is that a triple you had? I don't know. I'm oh, just someone them up. predator. Yeah, predator took that from you. Yeah. Oh, look at him trying to come down. They man. they just spawn in here. I mean, yeah. it's kind of hard to resist killing them. <laughs> they just show up. I figured, well, they, they came to play, so I'll <laughs> yeah, I'll shoot them. And as you guys know, I am a six-year-old rocking the I'm six clan tag. Yeah. So all these people here are getting pwned by uh, six-year-olds. Do you turn up your mic and um, with the, you know, with make the it voice sound changer? like a little girl? The voice changer. Yeah. Yeah, I naturally sound like a little girl. So. Oh yeah, that's right. You slowed this down. For both <laughs> yeah. of us, actually. You know, we don't need to modify your voice. Yeah, you know, it's like putting on makeup. It's yeah. Just for vocally. <laughs> so man, you're tearing it up here. Okay, so um, you know, speaking of. Kill death. Have you? Have you? Do you think in MW three your your kill death ratio has gone up or down since Call of Duty? I mean, since Black Ops. Well, obviously it did go up like a bunch from uh, Black Ops, but it's that's because I started to care about my KD like a month or two uh, before MW three came out. So I was bringing it up. But honestly, I rape face in Black Ops. It's like unheard. Yeah, you get of. dogs all the time. Now. Yeah, it's like almost every single game I would get dogs. It was just like sad. I, I gotta say, I miss those maps. Yeah, th those were some pretty good maps. Yeah, what do you think of the new maps? Oh, Liberation and Piazza? Yeah. Well, I think they're pretty decent maps. I mean, they're all right. Liberation is a little bit too big for my liking, but as you guys do know, I enjoy sniping. It's probably one of my favorite things to do in the game. That and run around with su a submachine, and I actually do have a couple sniping gameplays saved up. So will definitely be looking forward to those. Good spot on that one. You, I didn't even see the guy down there. Yeah. All right, so 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 then Piazza is an is an okay one too. Yeah, it's mainly meant for like shotguns and PP90s and MP7s. So it's close up. It's, is yeah. it like hard hat like like we're watching? Yeah, but it's actually a little bit smaller. And there's a bunch of stairs, just oh, wow. stairs upon stairs upon stairs. And yeah. also something that I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a tip on is with uh, the USAS and extreme conditioning. You get double the extreme conditioning, so like you can run for double the time you normally could even without extreme conditioning. But with extreme conditioning and the USAS, you can run for triple the time. Oh, and there's wow. also another thing where they buffed up the KSG-12. Oh my goodness, it's like. It's either that or the striker is the best shotgun in the game. It's wow. it's pretty beast. I think I think they nerfed the striker because I they, oh they totally did. Well, so that was that. I didn't like that. It, explain to me why why you don't like the nerfing of the striker. Well, <laughs> because it took me long enough to figure out. Oh, the striker is a good gun. I should get that up. And so right, I mean, it was probably like 
two levels before I got the extended mags, which have been right oh, that was right cheap. There. Look at this dude, M60 oh. with like what, like rapid fire yeah, and ACOG. No, ACOG. it was a long time ago. Yeah, I know, but with like a rapid fire and an ACOG. Oh which well, it's whatever. Just a, re a retard. So general. now, now you're throwing yourself on the ground, tears. You know, you almost threw the uh, controller into the backyard. I understand. Hey, I'm online. Um, so yeah, no, that's that was you tantruming, right? That's why you're yeah, standing there. And I just like pound my fists into the ground and start crying because it's a random. It was almost like a predator, right? At least predator, even you have a little bit of a chance to get away. There's no way you can get away from a, a car blowing up. Yeah, it's unlucky, ridiculous. unlucky. You was like predator attract pro or something. <laughs> I like am. I've got that on. I'm. I predators find me attractive. Yeah, I am beautiful to the predator. <laughs> so uh, that, maybe that's because I just don't run around as much as you run around. Yeah, that was bad. Okay, so um, so I, I got to thinking. You know, there was another school shooting this week. Oh my goodness! Yeah, I, luckily I I do not live in Ohio. Just telling you guys. Yeah, yeah, not in Ohio. So we lived through it. But, I've been uh, to Ohio. But you know, I, it's at times like that that people always turn to the the media and they go, "Oh, the media." You know, if it wasn't for these video games, oh my goodness, where people and movies haters, where just, people just, shoot each other, just like moms who are like, "Oh my goodness, all these little kids on their Call of Duty." Well, so they, then, okay, they mess with their okay. brains. And... Other than making fun of the argument, what's your rational explanation for why why you don't think that doing what you're doing right here would lead to actual violence in real life? Okay, obviously. The reason you're watching this video is either because you know me in real life or you play a lot of Call of Duty like me. And obviously, I wouldn't really think that you guys are too much of violent people. And the way that I'm going to explain this to you guys is, okay, say you're walking you're walking down the hallway at school and mm -hmm. you see, I don't know, uh, a rock or a bat or something like that. I don't know why you'd see a bat. but Like flying through the air a bat? No. <laughs> no, no, no. Like a baseball bat or something like Like a baseball like that. bat. Okay, and so, you're not just like, oh so my you're goodness, in, in, I have to. To resist the urge to bludgeon that person in the face. Oh, see, I thought you were gonna say play baseball. Oh, no, no, you don't do the. Do you know, does nobody use a baseball bat to hit a ball anymore? Is it just <laughs> just to hit people? Yeah. So the first thing you think, all right, okay. So what? Go on, go on. What's this? What's okay, this stunning so like, argument you're giving us about why nobody, this is not? Nobody violent? does that. I mean, if you do that, it, you're born with that. If you have like a mental defect, you're born with the urge to kill somebody or like some crazy psychopath. You're born with that. It's not. Oh, yes, because I have four days played on Call of Duty. I no. want to go around and kill people. I think it means it's when you're a parent. That's what. That's when you feel like killing people. <laughs> Short people yeah. in your house. Yeah. Uh, you have to hey, I'm, I'm getting pretty tall. You have to pick up their towel after them and uh, yeah. help them with, you know, I don't want to say anything about wiping, but, you know, go ahead. Yeah, I, I don't right, know you're... anything about being a father no, no. that you know of. Yeah. So, no, so, yeah. no, of course. So you think people, <laughs> it's not media, it's not the influence, it's... Um, Something that, that is unaffected by whether they play video games or not. Completely. So you don't think play, people who play video games are more likely to be violent? Okay, but take a commentator you know, C. Nanners. How okay. C. Nanners is not a violent person well, at all. You know, when you're nor making, is Woody. Okay, when you're making an argument, you can't find, pick out one person. That's anecdotal evidence. Okay, okay? take It does Woody. not hold true just okay. because you can find one person in one category. Okay, I'll give you multiple commentators right now. It doesn't play, matter. Play the game every day. Okay, so what would you say to people who say, all oh, right, well, the guy, and I don't know this to be true. I don't think it is true, actually, that this lady school shooting guy was, oh, he was big into Call of Duty. How would you argue that it didn't affect him? Um, by showing many, by taking, I don't know, a survey of many people, not a survey, maybe a test or something like that, because mm -hmm. obviously a bunch of people play Call of Duty, a yeah. bunch. Yeah, millions. Yeah, mil probably, I don't know, but a lot of people play, just yeah. just telling you guys that. And, and not everybody goes to school and shoots people? Yeah, I mean, some most of the Call of Duty players probably don't even go to school. Most of them probably, I don't know, 28-year-olds who are computer technicians okay. or construction workers. So you can't pin it on or, one thing. You can't say... Yeah, you, you know the people just because there's someone oh, bad who's yeah. you know what if you wore Nikes maybe it's people who wore Nikes yeah I don't know but I mean you know? like you said you can't just compare it on one person right like right no saying, doesn't you work can't compare it on one commentator you can't compare it on one killer there are multiple killers in the world right right and they all play Call of Duty I don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah sure <laughs> well you were killing here man yeah, what's I your know. final score I don't oh, know oh dead man that's dead my favorite hand. dead man's hand me. or it didn't you know. save me I. I actually Flash carried that over. Over. you know. I was used a prestige point <laughs> to get, get dead man's hand because yeah, I suck. Knew. It's one of my favorite ways to kill people. <laughs> <laughs> Run into it again right there. See? But, uh, thanks for watching, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this commentary. Haven't done it in a while. I Always had a good time. Yeah. Did you have a good time? I had a really good time. Always with the victory. We should do Huge this again. Bonus. Subscribe for more, guys. Will you Thank live you. with me? Please live in my house. I do. Oh, okay. We are out of here.